What's up, Dykes fam? What's up? We hope you guys are doing awesome today. How you guys doing? Great. We're good. Good. What are we doing, Mom? Well, we're checking on the daily process over at the Dykes fam forever house build. And there's been a tiny bit of change. <laughs> yeah. So we actually have a huge snowstorm coming in today. Looks like there's a bunch of clouds headed in from the south and we're hoping to be able to get a little more progress done before the snow gets here. Yeah, mm -hmm. so they better get back from lunch and get to work. <laughs> they better. <laughs> Let me show you what they've done so far. Look how cool the different colors of this dirt are. So cool. So mom actually wanted uh, tarp as our flooring <laughs> in our basement. Sorry, that's all we can afford. <laughs> we're, we're gonna go a little uh, old school and go with the tarp. No, the people are actually laying that down because they're gonna set the frames down to pour our foundation for our basement, which is super exciting. We don't just have a hole anymore, they're actually gonna pour the basement of our house. So if all else fails, Wait, we can live excited? in the basement. Yes. <laughs> That's where Nikoi can have. You can have the whole basement, Nikoi. Yeah. <laughs> you get the basement with the tarp floor. It's a little rustic, but it will do. <laughs> so anyways, uh, we just wanted to come do a property check, kind of give you guys an update where we're at and what I guess is going to happen next. But right now we also have to head somewhere. Where are we going, Nikoi? I have a basketball scrimmage today. That's right. And I'm going to go help out, huh? Mm-hmm. Dad came to basketball practice yesterday and what awesome things did he teach you, Koi? He taught us some like plays and formations. Are you gonna use them today? Yes. All right, you ready to go have some fun? Let's do this. Didn't work. <laughs> I fell. They tried. They tried. And we'll get better. Well, it's because the defense. They must have had spy cameras on our team or something. I think they watched our practice yesterday. So, back to the drawing board. Okay, guys, it is the weekend and it's time to have a little fun. <laughs> How about we make a snow volcano! Yeah. That's right, it's time for our favorite time of the week, homeschool science lesson. Yeah. William! Yeah. 
What experiment have you been dying to try? The Mentos soda explosion. Okay, so we have here our trusty Mentos original. And then what do we have here, William? Got some Diet Coca-Cola. Diet Coca-Cola. Diet works better than the regular, and we can talk about that after that. Let's hear our predictions over here. Do you guys think we should put all the Mentos in, or just one? Oh! Oh! oh, oh. <laughs> I say we put, a, we leave about like three. The bigger the better, right? Yeah. Oh, Nikoi. You don't want to put them all in? Well, she no. wants to eat them. <laughs> <laughs> throw it, we're How it about it. we have Nikoi put her face over the volcano and she can just drink all the soda as it comes out? Yeah, that's <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That way she can get her sugar fix. How high do you think the explosion's going to be, Nikoi? Five inches. Five inches out of the top of the bottle, okay? William? I say this high. How much is that? About four inches. Six inches? I can't really reach. Six inches? Yeah. A hand? Okay, Tayden? Um, I'm just gonna go with a foot. One foot. Yeah. Wow, that's This a is a wimpy volcano. But our last one yeah. didn't do so well. Do you guys remember baking soda vinegar? <laughs> How big do you think the Mento snow volcano is gonna be? I think it's gonna be big as the trees. Oh, it's gonna shoot to the trees? That's gonna shoot high as the trees. Holy yeah! cow, let's try it. So we're going to be using the tube method. If you make a tube to put your Mentos in and you cover the bottom, then you can drop them in Bloop! super quick. Because if you try to unwrap that thing and drop them in one by one, you're going to get exploded on. You're just going to go Right? Okay. Yeah. But first things, oh my gosh, you guys, it's really snowing. First things first, we've got to make the snow volcano. You guys ready? Okay. We found a spot where there's a lot of snow and the snow storm is all around. Don't shake it up. You're gonna release all the carbon dioxide before we're ready. Okay, perfect. We have buried our diet soda to make a snow volcano. Who is gonna put the Mentos in? I want to. Next task, open the Mentos and fill your Mentos dispensing tube. Oh, can we just throw that? In the bottle, so it will go higher? Yeah, no, because it can't dissolve the, now push the top, paper, push the so you wouldn't want to put that in there. Okay, you're just going to have to unwrap them all individually and put them in the tube. Science children, why does this reaction happen? Uh-oh, wasted! Mentos wasted! No, it still works. Okay, we need every single one of those. Why does this reaction work? Anybody know? Because the carbon dioxide. Uh, what, William? The carbon dioxide. What's carbon dioxide? Isn't it like chemicals? Yeah, but it's the stuff that's in the soda that makes it fizzy. Oh, yeah, fizz. Right? Yeah. Tayden, what's in soda that makes it fizzy? This is our science lesson for the day. What makes the fizziness, Tayden? They, what's it called? Chlor wait. Carbon <laughs> dioxide. Not the chlorine. Carbon <laughs> dioxide. No, Come on, your eight-year-old brother knows that it's carbon dioxide. Tayden, have you ever had a soda explode on you? Yeah. Yes. Well, I had yes. many. Many. Yeah, one time I shook it off on purpose. And I so know. all soda will explode. But this coating that's on the outside of Mentos, it like has like some kind of calcium in it or something that makes the bubbles, the carbon dioxide gas, get released quicker out of the soda. Now point number two, fake soda, the fake sugar that's in it actually re reduces the surface tension so that it can, the Mentos can penetrate that quicker and release that quicker. So if you do this, diet soda is better right here. Roswell, are you ready for an explosion? Oh yeah! Okay, the snow is falling. We have but our snow. But science is calling. <laughs> what kind? The snow is falling, but science is calling. <laughs> <laughs> the snow cannot stop us from science. Okay, don't let out all the carbonation. Wait, Hold on. So we're going to use the Dykes kids to be the judge of how high it goes. Okay, everybody ready? Oh, Baba! No! Help! Help! Run! Let him in! Oh, 
doing it because it was letting out all the carbonation so I had to hurry <laughs> but missed every single one except one half <laughs> okay so how much Mentos went into the thing a half two a half. what one half one <gasps> half of a Mentos yeah and, and then we and then we started chucking them in and it got to over a foot tall so with a half of Mentos, it probably went like two inches, right? Yeah. One inch. But then was... after you got what, like three in? Yes. It went a foot tall? Yeah. Uh -huh. So imagine if we would have actually gotten the entire pack. Oh. <laughs> Dang. That would have been oh, a well, yeah, But unfortunately, we will it's, never know thing was too because big. we fell. <laughs> you know what that means? If one guy fell, two. try, try again. Okay, Nikoi, walk to the store in the snow and go get us some new Mentos. Bye, Koi. Hey, yeah. no, I'm taking the truck. Bye, Koi. <laughs> uh, Guys, this is how real science goes. Sometimes things just don't happen the way that they should. But, you know, try this at home. Maybe you guys will have better luck than us. And make sure the Mentos actually get in the bottle. <laughs>